Okay. Um, oh, <coughs> excuse me. Okay, PHP my admin. We're going to install it on Ubuntu. I'm presently up at DigitalOcean. Uh, this is PHP my admin. Um, you can. It's oftentimes it's really the best way to interact with your database. Uh, you know, you can create databases, modify tables, do all sorts of things in a way that's you know just really much more easy, much easier, uh, intuitive, etc. You know, you've got a graphical user interface for doing that. Um, and so we're going to do that over at uh, um, DigitalOcean. And uh, so the first thing you want to do is you want to run this command. OK, and this will update your system. I've already done it. You know, it might take a couple minutes and just sit and wait while it does that. Um, the next thing you want to do is you want to type in this command apt get to install apps get install and then php my admin php dash mb string php get text okay okay do you want to continue yes okay now there's something very careful you you, you need to note right here you see how Apache 2, it's kind of highlighted? What you need to do is, the it will install incorrectly. Hit the space bar, and you see how that asterisk appears? You see the little star there? If you go through this process and you don't do that, it will not be properly installed because it'll be selected but not installed. Now you hit, uh, the tab key and now I see that OK is selected and I hit OK um, so it will essentially you know it will uh, you just need to be really careful with that um, now this we want to take the default here and so we're gonna keep it as yes okay now you can create your own password um, for the PHP my admin to register with the database and you want to whoops you want to confirm it okay now you also need you're going okay um, now Uh, that basically should do it. Now I'm, let's I'll look at my next uh, video because we're going to continue on with this. So this is.